Tonight, you are looking at security camera footage of the former McCrary County, Kentucky superintendent with a gun on district property. 10 News got this video through a public records request. Dr. John Gunn was charged with having a weapon on school property the day before the school board asked him to resign. 10 News reporter Vinay Simlot walks us through that video. On February 20th, the McCreary County School Board agreed to a settlement with Dr. John Gunn where he would step down as the school district superintendent. That very next morning, he was charged with bringing a gun to this building. Security camera footage 10 News obtained shows Dr. Gunn come to the school district office around 6 o'clock in the morning on February 21st. He pulls something out which looks like a gun. When he can't get into the district office, Dr. Gunn walks away. His citation says Dr. John Gunn was arrested at 10.50 later that morning. It says he admitted to having a gun while trying to enter the building. Dr. Gunn is charged with unlawful possession of a weapon on school property. The McCreary County Circuit Court says he pleaded not guilty to the charge. And it's a pleasure to be here. Larry Hammond will replace Dr. Gunn. He introduced himself at the board meeting on Monday. It's good to be here in the capacity of interim superintendent. I know that I'm sort of a transitional figure. In 2019, former McCreary County School Superintendent Michael Cash resigned over an inappropriate video. Dr. John Gunn sent his resignation letter to the school district on Wednesday. It says he will resign effective July 1st of this year. Now, we did ask the school board why they came to a settlement with Dr. John Gunn and why he agreed to step aside as the superintendent. The school district's attorney told me he could not tell us why. Back to you. Today, thank you. Dr. John Gunn's LinkedIn profile says he worked in Dixon, Mount Pleasant and Lawrenceburg, Tennessee before moving to Kentucky. Now we did reach out to the former superintendent and he said he did not want to comment for our story.